I don't think we're up for tag team action. I think we're just up for a good old fashioned show right now. As they are indeed bringing, hold on. Let's see what we have to say from Benjamin Steele. Ladies and gentlemen, I ask that you give it up one time for Golden Sheik, International. Had a little J-Rockish to it. Parker Williams, Mr. Mambo Italiano. Shout out to our confidants, Calvin Couture, and yours truly, Mr. Benjamin C. Steele. I like these guys. Now, time was in my day when you issued a challenge to two individuals, they manned up, they came down that ramp, and they got in this ring. But it seems to me that things have changed. So what I want is very, very simple. I want, Sister Malik, the team of Edric Everhart and Ty Cross, to come down that ramp and in this ring. The only thing that I want is those flannel wearing, Lion King theme music having funny beard looking hipsters walk on down so Golden Sheik International can show them who's boss. You know what, Shane? We've been and watching that's this. All you people need to know. Well, again, Rev, as I was getting to, tag team action here is what led to this whole confrontation back in February 10th. It was tag team action that saw. This group right here pitted against the robe-wearing European super stable that we see in the ring. But notice this isn't quite System Elite. If we take it even back, Edric, part of System Elite, actually injured his knee facing Duke Davis. And now, you guys, well, I think we have Keith Hodge. No, System Elite's not here, right? Yeah. Why not? You know, they're going to be here. Go it's, it's no. No, 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 no. You don't take news. You are a liar. No, 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 no. The fact of the matter is, and, and heed my advice, Mr. Hot, you need to leave because you, quite frankly, can't take on Golden Sheik International, and there is not a man alive that would be by your side that could do it. So, around and bring out System Elite. Oh, bring them out. You know what? Yes. You've been some of my friends all there long enough. And you know what? I'm the work guy. I have a partner. And don't worry. It's not a man. What? My partner is a honey badger baby! What? A honey badger. It's a vicious, small animal. I mean, I know what that is, but that's not what we're talking about. I think we are talking about a woman that is very well known within the Pittsburgh area that's not an animal, even though she sometimes wrestles. She's animalistic. Like, oh, she so is she, a mauler. She is a brawler. She does have some animal traits to her, as as we can see right oh, now. Come on, Rev. Anyway, she's moving in here to Stronghold Arena, and she's ready to brawl and display those traits. Just like a honey badger, she's prowling around the ring ready for the attack. You know what, Steve? The great thing about this Shane. is, oh, I'll get it right one day. The great thing about this is, I don't think we've seen Honey Badger in action for nearly a year. She suffered an arm injury. I think this is, the, this is the first time she's been back in over 365 days. And honestly, I'm extremely excited to see her. And I think the fans here in attendance are as well. And look at this. Cheap shots there, bringing them off the top rope. A shot there. Delivered into the corner. Honey Badger. Oh, look at this. This is. They're just getting out of the ring here instead of fighting. The fans want to see a fight. 